Hi everyone, welcome to BISB Solutions. This is Farha Alam and in this session we are going to see how can we load the organization business object in our cloud instance. So before we go and see how can we load this particular business object in our cloud instance, we need uh, or we should understand the basic concept of organization. Why, what is organization and why do we need it? to load in our cloud instance. So organization uh, organizations are basically departments, sections, divisions, companies, or other organizational units in our enterprise. We can define uh, organization or we can define uh, uh, organization hierarchies as well. So basically organization hierarchies helps us to manage the expenditure in the organization and reporting data and coordinate the project owning organization in our enterprise. That's why we need to uh, uh, create or define organization units in our uh, cloud instance. So uh, let's go ahead and see how can we load this particular business object that is organization in our uh, HCM cloud. So let me just move on to the instance. So here right now I am uh, on my instance home page. So this is basically my instance home page and then I have to uh, reach out to my uh, data exchange work area in order to load the file. So we just have to go to uh, my client group and click on this data exchange work area where it will be performed. So here we can see uh, import and load uh, data task over here. So we just have to click on it. And here we can see uh, some previously loaded uh, files over here. So I am just going to uh, purge or delete all the previously loaded objects from here. So let me delete or purge all these. So let's do it how can we do it we just have to click on uh, select it and click on delete and click on submit then that particular object will going to delete then click on refresh so here we can see uh, one organization file has been deleted from here. Now I'm going to delete all these files. So here we can see that I have removed all the previously loaded files from uh, here from this uh, important load data task area. Now I'm going to uh, show you my organization file which we are going to load. So basically in order to load the organization there, there are basically two, two components we need to load. Uh, there are two dependent components. First one is organization and other one is organization classification as uh, we had discussed that uh, we can define the hierarchies in the organization. That's why we need to uh, define the organization uh, classification as well under the organization. So both are dependent components. So we need to load uh, um, both of them together. So this is basically my uh, dead file. I'm just going to save it. Click on save is and I'm going to save it on my desktop. So extension will be organization dot dead. Save it. Or, uh, Okay, so let's save this file. So I'm going to save it on my desktop. Provide the appropriate location where you want to save it. I'm going to save it on my desktop. So organization dot dead is the extension for the file. Click on save. Previously it was showing that uh, this file is already exists. So I have uh, removed the previous. One. That's why I'll be able to save this one. So 
I have saved it and then I just have to compress it or so here uh, on the desktop we can see my organization file over here which is this one organization so I'm just going to compress it zip it so here one zip file has been generated for this one now I'm going to load it so we just have to click on this import file option and we have to select our file just go to the desktop and search for the file which is this one organization so let me import that organization file so we have to click on import and we have to select our appropriate file which is available on the desktop and here it is organization select it click on open click on this review parameter option and uh, here check all the and disable this delete source file uh, option so that I don't want to uh, delete this particular file from its source that's why I have disabled this option click on submit we got confirmation message that our process has been submitted click on ok and we have to refresh so here we can see our file import status is in uh, progress and lo load status is in uh, locked mode we have to refresh it keep on refreshing until we get the success message for both import status and load status so here we get uh, the success for both the status import status and load status we can see our organization has been successfully imported or loaded so this is how can we load the organization so uh, uh, our organization has been su successfully imported or loaded in our uh, uh, cloud instance so this is about uh, our today's session uh, if you have any question regarding this one, please uh, um, reach out to us at www.bispsolutions.com or www.bisptrainings.com. Uh, we will continue in our upcoming sessions. Thank you everyone.